Hey everybody, welcome back to my channel for another video today. I have a, another pretty large grocery haul for you guys. I went to two different stores this week. Um, if you saw my Sam's Club haul on Friday for you guys, then you know that I mentioned that I'm trying a new kind of new system this month where I'm trying to stock up on things kind of keep stock of everything. You guys are actually going to be seeing a full, like fully stocked pantry freezer tour or whatever on Wednesday, where I show you kind of where I'm keeping the overflow and all of that kind of like what my whole new system is. But if you saw that Sam's Club haul, then you know that I stocked up on a lot of stuff. And basically today I went to Food Lion and Aldi and stocked up on pretty much everything else that I wasn't able to stock up on at Sam's Club or that we didn't need in as high of a quantity or whatever, what have you. So um, stay tuned for Wednesday. I will show you guys my notebook, my lists, my categories, my pantry, my freezer, my overflow pantry, all of that you will see on Wednesday. So I spent uh, just under $200 today. I believe it was $182. I spent 82, uh, no, 185. So it was 82 at Food Lion and 103 at Aldi, which Aldi is a lot. You get a lot for $103. So without further ado, let's go ahead and jump into it. As always, prices will pop up on the screen for each individual item so that you will know um, for a price comparison or whatever what these things costed in my area. So let's go ahead and jump into it. It's so dark in here today. It's really like rainy and gloomy outside. I don't know if you can see that. And so like, you know, on those days where the whole house is just rainy and gloomy. Piper, child, you just love to be in my grocery house. Okay, so I got it all laid out here. We're gonna start with Food Lion first because it's on this side of the counter. The first thing that I grabbed is this Food Lion Texas toast. Now, I did get enough stuff to make spaghetti meals twice throughout the month, but I was worried that I wouldn't be able to fit two Texas toasts in my freezers after I like packed them full of everything else. So I only bought one and I will pick another one up the whatever the second week that we have spaghetti is. I've mentioned that I've been loving these vanilla double shot energy drinks by Starbucks lately. I love them so much. I drink one every afternoon. It's pretty much an addiction at this point, but it is definitely cheaper to buy them in the four pack than it is to buy them uh, in like individually. And I've looked on Amazon and everywhere else and I cannot find them any cheaper. Um, Amazon, they're like $30 for 12 and they're the bigger cans, which I probably won't drink. So anyway, I'm just going to keep buying them this way, I guess, and spending like $15 a week on coffee. Anyway, um, then I did go ahead and pick up some of the Coffee Mate Vanilla Caramel. I've never had this one actually, um, this brand. I usually buy the Food Lion brand or the vanilla, or I'm sorry, the, yeah, Cinnamon Vanilla Coffee Mate, but they didn't have either of those. So I decided to give this one a shot this week. Hopefully it is good. We've been out of Parmesan cheese for a while. So I grabbed one of these. Chris and Bryson use Parmesan cheese on pretty much anything they can put it on. So I know that they will be happy to have this restocked. We also were completely out of Marzetti Ranch. This is our favorite ranch. I used the last of it at dinner last night, actually, so I knew I needed to restock this. This is a pricier ranch. It's like $5.99, but it's so good. Um, I got some refried beans. So this is actually these two things. The pizza sauce and the refried beans are for tonight. So Chris likes um, refried beans. I mentioned this before on his homemade pizza when we make it. So this is for him. And then the regular food line pizza sauce is for pretty much everybody else. I did get a head of lettuce. We are having some black bean burritos this week as one of our meals. Um, I picked this up at food line over Aldi because the Aldi ones were all like really gross looking. So I went with the food line one. These Parker House Rolls, we use these for the Chicken Ranch Rhodes Rolls that we make. So we are going to have those this week as well. Bryson's been asking for them. So I went ahead and picked this up. This is 24 rolls and I usually make 12 at a time. So this will be two meals for us over the course of this month. I went ahead and grabbed 
hopefully for the month, green beans for the kids, or I'm sorry, green peas. My kids love green peas. So I got two of the giant, I believe it's a 32 ounce bag. Um, I don't remember how much this was. It'll pop up of course, but I do know that they told me they like the Food Lion brand ones over the ones that you can get at Aldi. So I went ahead and picked them up there. And then I got some of the Hidden Valley Ranch seasoning, a four pack. We definitely do not like name brand or store brand Hidden Valley Ranch or, you know, ranch mix. Um, we are Hidden Valley for sure when we use them in the Rose Roll. So I went ahead and picked up a four pack because the four pack was like six bucks and the singles were two for four. So it was uh, like almost a dollar cheaper to go ahead and get the four pack. There are two of these milks. Chris actually opened one and gave Finley some milk already. So I bought her two of her A2 milks. She goes through two every single week. And, you know, that'll be something that I continue having to go to the store for every week. Sprite for Bryson. I usually would purchase this at Sam's Club, but they had none at all available for my pickup order the other day. Uh, so I got him two of these six pack bottles. These were on sale three for 12. I should have bought in three. I don't know why I didn't, but I only bought two. And then I went ahead and restocked Kylie's Michelina's meals for this month. I got her four. Most of the time she'll eat like one a week on a, on a night that she just doesn't like what we're having. So there were one or two already in the freezer and I went ahead and picked up four more to hopefully get her through this month. And then I picked up one thing of veggie spirals. Again, we're going to have spaghetti twice, but they only had one bag. So I will have to grab that during that week. Again, like the toast that we eat the second thing of spaghetti. And then the last thing that I picked up at Food Lion are Bryson's pop tarts. So these are the frosted chocolate chip. I wish these were available in bulk at Sam's Club because I would buy the heck out of them, Sam's. Um, so yeah, I bought these there. They're actually cheaper at Walmart too, but I wasn't going to go a third place just for pop tarts. So these were like two sixty nine dollars for four well, eight, four packs. Um, so that'll get him through like a week <laughs> with the way he eats them. So that is everything that we got at Food Lime. Let's go ahead and start on Aldi. That was definitely the bigger haul. I bought these ready to bake pizza doughs last week and we haven't actually eaten them yet. We're going to eat them for the first time tonight, but I saw that they had some that were already, um, like risen and thawed. So I'm going to use these ones tonight. And then the ones that I bought last week that have been in the freezer, I am, will use another time throughout the month for, um, a meal. So basically I'm just stocking up on stuff that I know I get throughout the month. Anyway, meals that we eat a lot just to lower the weekly trip, not even like the budget, just the weekly trip because I don't like grocery shopping. <laughs> so, um, I'd rather, I think do it all at once and just get as much as I can at once and then go back for, you know, ingredients we need or whatever throughout the month. It's kind of what, it's another, uh, tip that I'm taking from Vanessa over at Lemonade Mom, and hopefully I can incorporate that into our lives. So anyway, these three will be used tonight. And then the other three that I have will go, will be in the freezer. I got a thing of whole milk for Bryson and Kylie. I got some fruit rounds. Um, Kylie and Finley don't care about the name brand Fruit Loops, but Chris and Bryson care about the name brand Cinnamon Toast Crunch. So I got the name brand um, Cinnamon Toast Crunch at Sam's, and then I bought Kylie and Finley these to top off their cereal container. Black beans for the black bean burritos I mentioned. We needed some mozzarella cheese for pizza tonight. So that was, you know, just basically for tonight. And then I did go ahead and get two of the Priano marinara sauces. I bought these for the first time last week and we really liked them. Um, I think we had spaghetti with it. Can't really remember. We did something with it. Um, Big ZD, that's what we did. And uh, everyone really liked it. So I bought these to have on hand for our spaghetti this month. Um, I would say that I liked these just as much as the Rayos one and they are so much deeper. So if you are a Rayos fan, give these ones a shot if you have an Aldi. Um, Bryson has gotten really into cinnamon rolls. So I got him two packs of cinnamon rolls to have throughout the month and they do not expire until June, June 19th. So if he doesn't eat, them both this month, which I'm sure he will, but if he doesn't, they will still be good. Chris asked me for some pepper jack cheese or to pick up some pepper jack cheese. Um, he really likes to have this in the afternoons when he gets home from work. Who remembers these? I raved about these last 
year and I was so excited to see them again. So these are a limited edition Chobani flavor, the layered raspberry lemonade Greek yogurt. They are so good y'all. So good. I've not seen these in any other store other than Aldi, like in Food Line or Walmart or anywhere else. I don't know if they like just sell these limited. So it's a limited batch. You can see it says right there. And they as well don't expire till June 12th. I wish I had bought more of them, but I only bought four. I'm hoping they still have some over the course of the next few weeks when I go back to Aldi. But I was very excited to find these, like so excited. Might eat one when I'm done. I uh, got no pulp fit and active 50 calorie orange juice for Chris. Two of my granolas. So I've been going through probably a bag every two weeks when I eat my yogurt bowls. Um, and I wanted to have it on hand for the whole month. So I got two and they actually were on sale this week for about a dollar cheaper than they usually are. Uh, so it was a little more cost effective to go ahead and buy two bags of them as well. Just one box of angel hair because we still actually have a pretty good amount left from last month, last week when I bought two. So this should get us through two spaghetti dinners, adding to what we already have on hand. Piper, get down, get down. Thank you, ma'am. Um, let's see, back here I bought two bags of the freeze-dried strawberries. My kids have been obsessed with these and I knew like we actually ran out yesterday um, for this week. And Finley was really mad this morning when there wasn't one. So to take in the car with her. So, um, I bought two of them and hopefully these last a little bit longer. That's pretty much the only snack that I bought because I did buy all of our snacks and all of our fruit and stuff like that at Sam's club. So if you want to check that haul out, it was Friday's video. So that'll kind of help you round out more of what we have or whatever. I got three of the chewy dip chocolate chip bars. Bryson eats like two of these every afternoon when he gets home from school. So he's going to be happy to find these. We did not have any left. He ate two boxes this week. I only bought three boxes because I only have so much storage and he has other stuff like the pop tarts and there's all kinds of stuff in there that we need to eat through. So I don't want to like get a ton of ton of stuff, you know, so I only got three. I'm trying this whole system out um, and hopefully we can, you know, adjust as we go. If I need to buy more next month, whatever, I will. But for now, he gets three of them. Um, I went ahead and got three of the raspberry lemonade drink mixes. Me and Kylie drink this like crazy. Um, so I know we will need these. And if we need more before the end of the month, then I will probably just pick them up at Food Lion. So I don't have to go all the way to Aldi. We'll see. Two of the chocolate chip things. These are milk chocolate morsels. I use these in my granola. I add some to the granola when I top my yogurt with blueberries and strawberries, and it's just so delicious. So I got two of them for the month. We also use them in pancakes, waffles, um, baking, you know, all, all types of stuff. So two of them hopefully should last us a month. I got two of my yogurts. I've been talking about this yogurt for weeks, and I love it so much. So this is the specialty specially selected indulgent greek honey vanilla yogurt guys this is so good it is seriously the creamiest like it is so good so if you haven't all the try this out because it is delicious um it's a little pricier but it is so worth it so i got two of those again this week we've been going through about two of these a week i think you can freeze yogurt so maybe i need to start buying more of them i don't know but for this week we have two two things of crinkle cut french fries we are having hot dogs and fries um, one night this week, so that'll get used, and then the other one will be for another meal. Actually, we don't really typically use a whole bag. So these two bags of fries will probably get three meals for us throughout the month. I got some eggs. Chris has been hard boiling them. These are strawberries that Finley was eating um, and eating them throughout the week. Having a sneezing fit right now. I've had to pause this video like three times in the last, like since I started talking about the fries. Anyways, Chris has been eating a lot of hard boiled eggs. So I went ahead and got him a dozen eggs. Nobody else really eats eggs a lot in my family. We're just not huge eggs eater, egg eaters. Um, the specially selected brioche buns. We love these. I get them every time. Um, I just went ahead and got these so that we can have them for hamburgers one night this month. It's not on the meal plan for this week. However, like I said, hot dogs is. So I got a thing of the pre-sliced hot dog buns. And then the final thing that I picked up are the marbled cinnamon bread. Chris asked for these and I went ahead and got two. He can go through like a loaf a week. So I'll probably freeze one and then the other one we will leave out. And that is our giant stock up haul for this week. 
I hope that you enjoyed this video. Please let me know by giving this video a thumbs up and I will see you guys on Wednesday. Like I said, we're going to sort of delve more into how I have everything set up, how we're doing it all and all of that. So stay tuned for that video. Um, until then guys, I hope you have a great start to your week and I will see you soon. Bye guys.